So what I would like to do right now is invite one of our partners who's doing just that to come and talk to you about what they've been doing. I'd like to welcome the general manager of Foxconn's Innovation and Digital Systems Business Group, Young Lu, out to talk to us about what you've been doing in Dallas. Thank you. Thank you for coming to Computex. Thank you so much for inviting me to be here at the Computex. Good afternoon, everybody. Our relationship with Intel and Foxconn on tablets started about five months ago. Not that long ago. Right. Ever since then, we made more than 10 tablet designs. And some of them has already begun shipping. Fantastic. That's, that is actually incredibly fast. I think everyone in this audience would appreciate that. Um, in only five months, you're already shipping tablets. And did you bring something to show us today? Well, of course. I wish I could have wear the t-shirts and jeans. But I don't have it. Is it that in your pocket? <laughs> my pocket. This is a performance level. Designed with uh, Basefield CR, yep. with full HD support, and will be launched in the next month. And I, I noticed that you have uh, Foxconn has really been working on the display technology and beautiful picture quality. Yes. Yeah. Video up there for us, yes, of course. There's a full HD uh, video. You know, Foxconn, the reason why we can do it in such a short period of time because of uh, our vertical integration capabilities. Mm -hmm. you know, today, which is different from the PC era, that most of the tablet designs require very compact, mm -hmm. you know, a very, very compact design. And with that compact design, most of the, the key components require customization and also performance optimizations. Right. Therefore, the vertical integration capability is so important. To getting quick. To getting design. quick. Yeah. Right. That's yeah. why we can do you know, more than 10 designs in five, five months. months. Yeah. Well, it's very, very beautiful, and we're very glad to be working together in this area. Is there yeah. anything further you want to tell us about what you guys are doing? Yes. So I think uh, with the uh, tablet and uh, uh, the mobile devices, not only we need to provide a second to none hardware, but also we need to provide a service, cloud services, you know, the ecosystems to support, mm -hmm. to provide good user experiences to the devices. Foxconn has been you know, enhancing our capability in software, cloud, server, and networking. Wow. Yeah. I think with those capabilities, we're able to provide our customers with a seamless user experience. We are very excited about our partnership with Foxconn and certainly thrilled that in five months you've got 10 designs and you're ready to go to market. And thank you for joining us and showing us your beautiful new system. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we've been collaborating with Intel from Tablet devices to data center servers. All the way to the data center. Yes. We look forward to working with Intel to provide our customers with ecosystems and services with Intel solutions. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Today, as we focus on mobility and low power uh, and connectivity, we certainly have not abandoned our passion for performance. We want to deliver the most exciting, the most breathtaking computing performance available. Performance is delivered, as we discussed, through the evolution of Moore's Law and the leadership that Intel has pioneered in the transistor area and in our leadership in the semiconductor industry. So what I'd like to do is take a tour of performance and start by showing you the incredible performance of Intel Atom-based tablets. We're going to go way over here. Tech's going to help us out. Hey, Renee, how's it going? So you've been talking about all the great performance we have 
of our, with our new Atom processor, formerly known as Beta Rail. So I wanted to give you some examples of how that works with games and with photo editing. Okay. So the first thing I'd like to show you is we have a game here from EA Sports called SSX. Now, a great game. It's a fun game. I've actually yep. played it. See the details up on your screen there? And this has great graphics, stunning visuals. That's really made possible with that new Atom processor, the Intel HD graphics, and the ability to run OpenGL ES 3.1. I mean, that really brings a level of detail and visualization to this game that you really don't normally see in something this small. So let's take a look at what the game looks like. Now you can see even the smoke, it's all, it's all dark and cloudy at the bottom, yep. and it rises up, gets all opaque, just like a wood in real life. So we're ready to go. I'm going to come yep. over here and watch you play and see how you do. Oh, I'm going to do awesome. You're going to do awesome. See, right into that tree. Not many people can do that. Careful. But see, look at the great shadow detail, the snow. It's as good as putting it on the console. That's exactly. unbelievable. And, and a console, you might get that Okay, tree. so you just want to return. <laughs> But again, you don't normally get this level of detail and visualization and frame rates in something this small in life. That's, that is true. Wow, now, that's stunning. In photo editing, now I have two tablets here, uh -huh. one with our Atom processor, one with our competition's latest and greatest 801 um, Qualcomm processor. Okay. Now, I've got two pictures here. They're both identical. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm gonna take, we wanna remove the sandals from the beach. So if you could actually hop on the Qualcomm there, we're just gonna right. digitally remove these. Need the eraser of the sandals here on Qualcomm. Oh. I think I got that. Oh, mine's here. Oh, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh, the eraser? Yeah, not yet. <laughs> Mark our erase. I know. There has to be one demo that does this too. <laughs> not working? It's not working. <laughs> it would not be a keynote without a demo that didn't work. Let's see. Remain calm. Well, here, I'll go ahead and I'll just restart that. It's going to restart it. It's actually a stunning demo, so I'd like to make it work. No, it doesn't like you. It doesn't. All right. We can come back to it. Okay. We'll reset it. <laughs> All right. So here we have some phones as well. You want so to talk about what's on the phones? On the phones, we've got actually that exact same. We've got our Morefield processor, mm -hmm. and we have that Qualcomm 801 in our two competitive phones, one from, from two different manufacturers. Mm -hmm. And we're running a benchmark called Mobile Expert that you can see it does an aggregate score showing performance of right. those processors. Now, if you look at the top line, you'll see that we have a score on our Morefield processor that's drastically faster than the 801. And you can see Absolutely. if you go down on each of the workloads, how we're faster on every line. But I'd really like to call attention to that one second from the bottom. It's Security. called encrypt personal content. Mm -hmm. We're not just faster, we're drastically faster. Yeah. And that's because our processor supports AES&I, which means that hardware encrypts at the hardware level. So everything on your phone, all your data, is perfectly safe and secure. That's fantastic. Well, I hope you get that going, and we'll see if you can make it work, and we'll come back to you. I'll get that going. <laughs> that's a, that was unfortunate, but it happens. So as we're continuing to push performance forward on all of our platforms, really to enable the overall user experience like we saw in the first demonstration with the gaming, we continue to push forward as well on core experience for mobile as well. So Taiwan's a special place for innovation. I talked about that a minute ago. So where better to discuss our newest innovation and talk about our new 14 nanometer product? With 14 nanometer, we're going to continue to deliver breakthroughs in mobile performance. The new core processor family will be, you can see this, this will be core level performance, 14 nanometer based product that will be well below 10 watts TDP. That means these will be fanless based systems. This is one of our reference designs. And as you can see, we also have it in the two-in-one, which docks, as well as the tablet form factor. And we have a full docking capability that gives you full desktop. It comes right out so you can have a thin and very light 
laptop, fanless, all core performance. This is what the breakthrough in semiconductor technology provides you. That's why we think it does matter. Moore's Law does matter. It's what allows you to bring all the vectors of performance to mobile computing. So today we have an announcement to make. I am personally very, very honored to be able to make this today. We are announcing our first, we can forward this, there we go. We're introducing the Intel 4M processor. This is our four, first 14 nanometer part. It's cool, it's quiet, it's lighter, it's thinner, and it's the most energy efficient core processor in Intel's history. And I'll hold it up for you again in case you didn't see it. So the product line will be called the Core M. And we'll also have Core M for V Pro as well. Blazing fast for smooth applications. This holiday, you will be able to purchase systems built on Core M. Yesterday, ASUS announced their first product, which you'll be able to get. It's the Transformer T300 Chi. You can see it. I certainly only need one hand to hold this. And this is the innovation of what 14 nanometer brings us in core mobile performance. How are you doing over there? We're ready to go. He's ready. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> Not to take away from this, which I am personally, I mean, I'm hoping you're all digesting what I just told you. A fanless core based machine that looks like this, right? Okay. Yes. Okay. <laughs> just wanted to check to see if you were awake after lunch. All right, how are we doing? So okay. we've erased the sandals. Right. Adam, the trail, our competitor's machine. So now I'm going to hit Now what's going to happen? Go. Now you can see it's going to it's going to remove those sandals from the beach, and you can see that our Adam's done, and Qualcomm's going, and going, and now it's done. So you can see once we get it going, it's drastically faster. Thanks, Ray.